So I recently spun out from my lab a, a company called Charisma Therapeutics. The idea there was um, came out of work that um, my, gradu my first graduate student did in my lab starting about four or five years ago, which was to ask the question, um, we are seeing what CAR T-cells can do, predominantly in hematologic malignancies, yet CAR T-cells have been tried and have not so far made much of a dent in solid tumors. And the question that we asked each other back, back in the day was, maybe T-cells aren't the right effector cell type to be going after for solid tumors. What is a more potentially appropriate cell type? And when you look at a variety of different solid tumors, you can see that amongst the um, immune inf infiltrating immune cells, macrophages are very, very abundant. In fact, most cancers uh, um, subvert macrophages co uh, and turn them into tumor-associated macrophages that are actually immunosuppressive. And so we, we asked the question, can we make uh, very potent macrophages that are redirectable to the tumor by putting a car on them and that are also um, resistant to being subverted by the tumor microenvironment. And so that's in fact what we found. We, we found that we can make these, these um, macrophages. They're made from peripheral blood mon monocytes from donors, normal donors or from cancer patients ultimately, um, that we can uh, make a, a good number of macrophages. We can redirect them to eat phagocytose and eat um, so, uh, cancer cells at, at will, so redirectable to the cancer cells that we want them to, to, um, to phagocytose, that those macrophages um, can, can um, stimulate T cells, so they can present antigen to T cells and stimulate the T cells. And then in some preclinical studies, we've shown that the macrophages can actually generate an anti-tumor response. And so <clears throat> what was very important to, and remains very important to me is to be able to take these observations from the lab to the clinic because frankly, none of this means anything if it doesn't actually uh, have an effect in, in people with cancer. And so to do this, it's really important. It is basically impossible to do without um, some sort of pharmaceutical or biotech support. And um, we decided at the time that it made most sense to uh, start up a, a brand new company to do this. And so the company is now devoted very almost, almost single-mindedly to bringing the first trial of anti, um, anti HER2 um, macro car macrophages to, uh, to patients with uh, metastatic solid tumors.